President-elect Donald Trump turned to former Goldman Sachs banker and movie financier Steve Mnuchin to be the next Treasury Secretary. We're working on the economic plan of the transition, making sure we get the biggest tax bill passed. The 53-year-old was Trump's campaign finance chief, building a network of donors to support Mr. Trump's general election campaign. Mr. Mnuchin has strong ties to Wall Street after a 17-year career at Goldman Sachs, where he pioneered block trading, the selling of big chunks of shares at once. This makes him a traditional pick for the job, but contrasts with Mr. Trump's message. Wall Street has caused tremendous problems for us. Mr. Mnuchin has given mostly Democrats in recent years. He gave the maximum amount to Mrs. Clinton's presidential primary bid in 2007. Then after her loss to Obama, he donated to the Obama campaign. When Mr. Mnuchin signed on to the Trump campaign, many of Hillary Clinton's major fundraisers were shocked. Mr. Mnuchin was born to a Jewish family in 1962, and his father also worked at Goldman Sachs. He graduated from Yale University, where he was also the publisher of the Yale Daily News. Mr. Mnuchin has shown a taste for Hollywood glamour. He's been one of the few Wall Street financiers to make money investing in films. His firm, Dune Entertainment, teamed up with 21st Century Fox to fund a series of films, including the blockbuster moneymaker Avatar. He's also invested in more recent films, like American Sniper and Mad Max Fury Road. What's next? The Senate still needs to confirm the Treasury nominee, but the former Goldman Sachs banker's credentials will likely make him one of the least controversial of Trump's cabinet picks.